made it. You've arrived. This is Peter Levitan's Advertising Stories. And you're about to hear entertaining, personal, often instructive stories from deep inside the world of advertising. Howdy. Welcome to Advertising Stories. This is Peter Levitan. A couple of years ago, I wrote the book, The Levitan Pitch, Buy This Book, Win More Pitches. The book was designed to help advertising agencies win more new accounts by being better presenters, better pitchers, smarter new business people. I interviewed 30 experts to help me get my major points across. One of my favorite interviews was with the uber-famous Bob Hoffman. Bob offers super honest, absolutely no bullshit advice from the leading honest, no bullshit voice in the world of advertising. Bob is known for his very outspoken opinions about advertising industry lunacy, including rampant media fraud. He has the number one best-selling book on advertising about the world of advertising and his weekly rants as the ad contrarian. Speaking of outspoken, Bob, who I interviewed via email, is being represented today by my artificial, intelligent voice friend, Tom. Before we get into Bob's seven points about pitching, this is how a contrarian thinks about the advertising industry. Take it, Bob. Nobody really knows what creativity is. Every year, thousands of people take a pilgrimage to find out. This involves flying to Cannes, snorting cocaine, and having sex with smokers. Now, Mr. Hoffman, I'd like to go back to my book on pitching and your views on the advertising agency pitch process. Please don't hold back like you would. 1. You can't be everyone's girlfriend. Do not pitch every stupid thing that comes along. Don't try to fit yourself into every box. Not everyone is going to love you, and not everyone is going to buy your story. Pick your spots. 2. Do what you tell your clients to do. The first thing we tell our clients is that they have to differentiate themselves. It is the one thing agencies never do. They all sound the same. Look the same. Smell the same. Decide who you are and how you are different and better. If you can't do that, hire Peter and let him do it for you. 3. Be clear on your objective at each stage. This is really important. A new business pitch is a three or four step process. At each stage, your one and only objective should be to get to the next stage. You will not win the account at the first stage. At the beginning, Stage clients are not looking to hire an agency. They're looking for reasons to eliminate agencies. Give them reasons why they should continue talking to you and don't give them reasons to eliminate you. 4. Make the presentation you want to make. Not the one you were asked to make. For the final pitch most of the time clients and search consultants provide you with outlines of the presentations they want to see. Throw it away and make the presentation you want to make. Remember you have only one shot. Only. 5. Only let the good presenters talk. There are brilliant people who are lousy presenters. And dumb ass bozos who are great presenters. Only let the good presenters present. 6. Have a strategy and stick to it. The final presentation should have a theme, and every section of the presentation should spin off that theme and point to a conclusion where the strategy is clearly and creatively defined. 7. By the way, the best new business program is a good reputation. Duh. Well, that was my AI friend representing the voice of Bob Hoffman. You can learn more about Bob and my book, The Levitan Pitch, on my website at peterlevitan.com. Hey, please do me a big favor and subscribe to Advertising Stories. Google likes that. Apple Podcasts likes that. I like it. And I have many more cool interviews scheduled. And of course, you can like and review advertising stories and tell all your friends. Big thank yous to the people that helped me get advertising stories out the door a couple of times a week. Lady Gaga, thank you so much. Holly O'Malley, thank you. Rick Rubin, Meek Mill, and Celia Cruz. Mucho gracias. I'll see you guys next podcast.